Welcome to the Word of Victory online with Bishop Mike Bomadele. I adore you. Loving King, loving King, sweet, sweet Jesus, you are a good God. We praise you, we praise you, loving King, loving King, sweet Jesus, sweet Jesus. We Nothing shall remain small around you. Welcome to the Word of Victory. On the Word of Victory, I pray this hour that all your adversaries will scatter. The Bible says, let the Lord arise, let his enemies be scattered. Whatever represents an enemy of God in your life, I pray that they will be scattered and they will not be able to regather in the name of Jesus. Whatever they decided on their last gathering against you, I declare that it shall not stand because the scripture says, associate yourself together, take counsel, it shall not stand. Every counsel to make your home to be destroyed shall not stand. Every counsel to make you fail exam shall not stand. Every counsel that your business will remain small shall not stand. Every counsel to bring you sickness and disease, that counsel shall not stand in the name of Jesus. Wherever the enemy have gathered to take a decision over your well-being, I declare that their plans scatter in the name of Jesus. You can join me to say, let God arise. Let his enemies in my life be scattered. Let God arise. Let his enemies in my life be scattered. And one of the enemies is smallness. To remain small, you can have victory over smallness. It begins by thinking like God. Genesis 15, he said, come and you will be like the stars in heaven. Your, your children will be like stars in heaven. Genesis 13, he said, they will be like the dust of the earth. And then Genesis 22, he said, they will be like the sand on the seashore. Can you see what God compares his blessing to in our life? So that's why we must shake out the mentality of smallness. That's where it begins. He compares his blessings to the dust. That's uncountable. He compares it to the stars. Now, that's uncountable. He compares it to the sand on the seashore. My, that is too much. That's what we have been brought into. That's why I know that all your needs will be met. All your projects will be accomplished. That's why I know that anywhere you are going, he will take you. It's just a matter of walking with him. You see, faithfulness in a little will lead to having much. In Luke 16, he said, if you are faithful in that which is little, much will be given unto you. But if at the time that it is small, you are careless with it, you despise it, you look down on it, you are not conscious of working hard because it is small. You say, when I become bigger, I will be faithful. When the thing is more, I will take it more serious. If you are careless, lazy, slothful, I don't care, you know, you don't wake on time. You don't come to work on time because you say it is small. How many people are there? It's only two students in my school. Why should I be struggling? I know I will take care of them later. That's how you will remain small. In fact, that too will soon be collected from your hand. You will close down, you shut down and go home. But if you take it serious and you say, Lord has given me this too. Let me do all I can faithfully. Let me be true to these ones. They are the only ones that are staying with me. I must give them my best. When you give them your best, they become robust. They will become so robust that they will go and call others. Others will even see them and say, I want to be like this. And then they will join. Be faithful in a little and then much will be given to you. Smallness is destroyed in the name of Jesus Christ. You will increase. You will become great. Things will become better in Jesus Christ mighty name. I'll be with you next time on the Word of Victory. My name is Mike Bamidele. I'm itching to come to your environment wherever it may be on the face of the earth as he said to us to go ye. And we have come virtually to you. We have come online to you. 
blessings will also locate you in that way. Whenever we come your way, life will be so excited to see you. Amen. Till then, victory is yours. Hello, parents and children. I have a very special invitation for you to a children's special service, Sunday, 29th of May, 2022, at 9 a.m. at Victory Chapel International. It shall be a time that hands will be laid on you for the impartation of supernatural gifts. The theme of our service is, I'm a gifted child. Say, I'm a gifted child. Make sure that you are there and your children are there with you. Children, see you then on Children's Special Service. Thank you for watching. We believe this broadcast has blessed you. Word of Victory was brought to you by the continuous giving of friends and partners of Mike Bamidele's ministries. For more information, call plus 234-0813-075-0010 or www.victorylifeministriesinternational.org. Until next broadcast, victory is yours.